Hello students! Nice to see you again everyone! And now please welcome back to our Brawl English class! And yes students, for today, I'm your English teacher, so you can call me Teacher Fun. It's nice to see you again! For today everyone, we are going to find out more with our new wonderful story! Yes! Are you excited? Yes! Very nice student! Did you feel excited too to watch our new story? Alright, but before we move to our program, yes, we are going to sing and dance first. Alright, let's stand up everyone, stand up! Let's sing and dance together with our first song that we call Hello Hello Song. Don't forget to sit up like this everyone. Now let's move and count together. Go! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Hello, hello. Can you clap your hands? Hello, hello. Can you clap your hands? Can you stretch your fly? Can you touch your toes? Can you turn around? Can you say hello? Let's say hello. Good job. Do it again. Hello, hello. Can you stamp your feet? Hello, hello. Can you stamp your feet? Can you stretch your high? Can you touch your toes? Can you turn around? Shopping. Yes, our title is for Mom is too busy with shopping. 
Oh, maybe the boy and his mom, maybe they're going to the shopping mall together to buy something. Oh, do you want to join with them? Yes. Excellent, student. But this time, before we are going to find out with our story box. Yes, Tisha has some questions to ask all of you again. Let's answer our questions first. So now we move to our daily routine. And let's begin with the first question that Tisha wants to know. And this question is, listen to me, how are you? Yes, student, how are you today? And how do you feel everyone? For today, are you sleepy, student? Are you sleepy now? No, I'm not. Good job. If you are not sleepy, this time, what about sad, everyone? Are you sad? No, again. Well done. If you are not sad, all right. This one, let's find out. What about happy, student? Are you happy? Yes. Oh, great work. So if you say yes, let's practice with me. You will say, I am happy. Now your turn. I am happy. Very nice. All right, this time, let's practice more. So every said, I am happy. You have to act like this. Yes, after that, don't forget to keep smile. Big, big smile. So practice with me. Let's say and act follow me everyone. Now you will say, I am happy. Now your turn. I am happy. Wonderful. All right, let's find out more with our next question. And the next question is, listen carefully. How's the weather? Yes, this question is asking for how's the weather, student. It means teacher want to know about the weather. All right, we are going to check out together. But this time, listen carefully. How's the weather? And say with me, how's the weather? Your turn. How's the weather? All right, before we check up with all the choices that we have this time, student, let's look at the outside first. Please look at the window. Oh, after that, tell me, student, how's the weather? We're going to check up with this one. Look. It's cloudy. So, this weather is for cloudy. Yes, we have a lot of dark clouds over there. Look at the sky. Is it cloudy, everyone? No, teacher. Oh, no. Good job. No, it's not cloudy. No, it's not. Excellent. All right, let's find out more. If it's not cloudy, what about this one? Look. It's windy. Yes, this weather is for windy, windy. Look at the outside again, student. Is it windy now? No, it's not. Oh, no, it's not. Excellent. Now it's not windy too. Good on you, everyone. All right, let's check out with another one. What about this? Look. Here is it. It's sunny. Wow, this weather is for sunny, sunny. Yes, it's so bright and shy. You can find the big sun over there. All right, still there. Look at the outside again. Is it sunny now? Yes, it is. Oh, yes, it is. Now it's so bright and shy like this one because it's sunny. All right, let's practice with our sentence. Listen first. It's sunny. And then say with me. It's sunny. Now back to you. It's sunny. Good job, student. All right, let's practice more. So this time, everyone, when you say it's sunny, you have to move your hand together like this, side to side for sunny, sunny. Very nice. All right, now practice together. Listen first. It's sunny. After that, let's say and act follow me. And you will say, it's sunny. Sunny. Now your turn. It's sunny. Oh, fantastic, student. Yes, today it's sunny. 
All right, now we have answers some of our questions from part of daily routine already. We get back to our screen. And for today, let's find out with the new story. All right, and the title of our new story is, listen. Mom is too busy with shopping. And repeat after me. Mom is too busy with shopping. Your turn. Mom is too busy with shopping. Oh, yes. They are going to the shopping mall. Do you want to join with them, student? Yes. Let's find out with part of story box. Yes, we are going to watch the whole story of Mom is too busy with shopping together. So, don't forget to pay attention with other stories. Story box. Mom is too busy with shopping. Look at the story. Oh, mommy is here. I want to go shopping. Let's go shopping. I want to go shopping too, mom. Oh, yes, see then. This part we have the boy and his mom's over there. Now his mom, she wants to go shopping at the shopping mall. Then she asks out to her son, Oh, do you want to go shopping with me? Then this boy, student, teacher will guide you. His name is Tom. Yes, his name is Tom, student. Let's say hello to Tom. Say with me. Hello, Tom. Your turn. Hello, Tom. Yes, keep reminding that he is Tom and his mom. So now, yes, Tom, he is agree with his mom. So it means they are going to the shopping mall together. Who want to join with them? Show me your hands. Excellent. Now, let's go shopping. Go to the shopping mall by car. Finally, everyone. Oh, now they arrive at the shopping mall together. Now, look at Tom's mom. She get into the clothes shop. Still then, the dress shop is over there. Look at her. Look at her eyes. I want a shirt. How much is it? It's ten dollars. Oh yes, student. This part, Tom's mom, she needs some shirt, student. And then she asks him to this seller. Oh, I want a shirt. How much is it? Then this seller, she shows the price of the shirt. Oh, here it's ten dollars. But student, look at Tom. Where is he going? Guess what? Oh, maybe he's going to the toy shops over there. Maybe, but let's check out. What is that? What is that? He found something. He moved to toy shops still then. It's a nice robot. Mom, I want this robot. How much is it? It's nine dollars. Oh, yeah, still then. Now, Tom, he gets into the where is now? Toy he shop. shop. For toy shop. Excellent. Yes, now Tom, he needs this nice robot. Oh, then he asks him to his mom, Mom, I want this robot. And after that, Tom's asking about a ply from this seller. How much is it? Then he showed the ply. How much is this, everyone? Oh, good. Robot. It's it's nine dollars. Excellent. This robot is nine dollars. Very nice. But look at his mom over there. Wait a minute, Tom. I'm busy. Oh yeah, see you then. His mom up Tom. Oh Tom, you have to wait a minute. Because now she's busy. She just choosing her new clothes, see you then. Alright, let's find out more. He's going to go These are nice crayons. Mom, I want these crayons. How much is it? It's $8. Oh, yes, yeah, student. Now, Tom, he moved to the stationery. Oh, now, Tom, he wants some crayon. Yes, these are nice crayons. Then, he's arguing about the price from the seller again. Oh, Steven, how much is this of these crayons? It's eight dollars. Excellent. This crayon is eight dollars. Very nice. And this time, his mom's still busy again. So now, Steven, his friend, the little girl, she said, 
Wait a minute, Tom. Your mom is busy. Oh, yeah, it's your mom is busy, Tom. She got a new hat already. Is this beautiful? Yes. Yes, it looks beautiful. It's suitable with her. All right, she has buy all the things that she want already. And this time, what will happen? Tom, Tom, where are you, Tom? Oh, she's looking for her son. Where are you, Tom? Did you see a boy? He is wearing a yellow hat. A yellow hat? He's over there. Yes, after that, Tom's mom, she comes to this man. Oh, excuse me, did you see the boy? He's wearing the yellow hat that she is arguing to this man. Then this man, he said, a yellow hat is over there. Oh, wow, student, is this Tom here? Maybe. Maybe, oh, maybe Tom is here. All right, let's check out together. Are you Tom? Oh, it's a pet shop. It's a cute cat. I want this cat. How much is it? It's ten dollars. All right, student. Now, the yellow one. Is this Tom, everyone? No, it's oh, not. Oh, no, it's not. It's a dog. So, where is this now? This shop is for? Pet shop. Pet shop. Very nice. Oh, it's not Tom here. So, in the pet shop, yes, we have some of pets. Oh, it's a cute pet over there. Then, we have these ladies. She is want to buy a cat still then. Then she asking about the price of this cat from the seller. How much is this of this blue cat, everyone? It's ten dollars. Very nice. It's ten dollars. But now, where's Tom? Let's find out together. Look at that, Mom. Did you see a boy? He is wearing a red shirt. A red shirt? He's over there. All right, and this part, everyone. Tom's mom, she's arguing to the seller of the pet shop. Yes, did you see the boy? He's wearing a red shirt. Then she said, a red shirt? He's over there. Is this Tom, everyone, over there? Yes. Oh, yes, it looks like Tom. Yes, let's check out everyone. Oops. Is this Tom? No. No, again. What is that? Bag. Yes, it's a bag. And now we are in the... This shop is for? Bag shop. Yes, it's for bag shop, student. A bag store. All right, let's check out with this part. It's a bag shop. It's a nice bag. I want this bag. How much is it? It's $7. All right, student. And the bag shop. Now we have this old man. He's want his bag, student. Then he's arguing to the seller. I want this bag. How much is it, student? How much is this of this bag? It's it's seven dollars. Excellent. It's seven dollars. All right. Now this time, look at Tom's mom again. Did you see a boy? He is wearing blue pants. Blue pants? He's over there. Yes, and this time, Tom's mom, she is arguing to the seller of bag shop. Did you see the boy? He is wearing blue pants. So he said, blue pants, he's over there. Oh, here? Maybe Tom here. What do you think, everyone? Is it Tom? Yes. Oh, yes. All right. Let's find out together. Again. It's a toy shop. Did you see a boy? He is wearing a yellow hat, a red shirt, and blue pants. Oh, yes, student. Now, Tom's mom, she get into the toy shop. Yes, in the toy shop, we have some children over there. And here, this clown. So, she asks. Oh, everyone, did you see the boy? He is wearing a yellow hat, a red shirt, and blue pants. Oh, after that, the clothes he says. I'm sorry, I didn't see a boy. Oh, he didn't see the boy, still then. All right, let's find out more. Oh, now, look at Tom's mom, everyone. 
everyone. What is she doing? Look. She is crying. Oh, she is crying. Why not? All right, let's check out. Oh, oh no. Oh, Where are you, Tom? Yes, she didn't smell Tom. Mom, are you okay? Oh, and suddenly, everyone, Tom is here. He comes into his mom and then he's asking to his mom, Oh, mom, are you okay? Why are you crying? All right, look. Where were you? Where were you? Are you still busy? No, I'm not busy. Now let's buy your robot and crayons. All right, at the end of the story, student, finally, Tom's mom, she can find Tom already. So now Tom, he asking to his mom, are you still busy, mom? And then his mom said, oh no, Tom, not busy. And then they are going to buy some robots and crayons together. The end with our story of mom is too busy with shopping yes she looks busy with shopping she found a lot of things that she wants but she didn't take care to tom as much all right that all with the story so this time student we are going to watch our whole stories together one more time and this time let's see mom is too busy with shopping I want to go shopping. Let's go shopping. I want to go shopping too, Mom. Yes, let's go to the shopping mall. I want a shirt. How much is it? It's ten dollars. What is that? A nice robot. Mom, I want this robot. How much is it? It's nine dollars. Wait a minute, Tom. I'm busy. This mom is busy. It goes to stationery. These are nice crayons. Mom, I want these crayons. How much is it? It's eight dollars. Wait a minute, Tom. Your mom is busy. It's mom still busy. She's going to buy some hat. And this time? Tom! Tom! Where are you, Tom? Did you see a boy? He is wearing a yellow hat. A yellow hat? He's over there. Oh, yes, a yellow hat is over there. Is this Tom here, everyone? No. Uh, no, all right, let's check out together. This is no. a pet shop. It's a cute cat. I want this cat. How much is it? It's $10. It's a dog. It's not Tom. Did you see a boy? He is wearing a red shirt. A red shirt? He's over there. Oh, yes, a boy who is wearing a red shirt. Is this Tom here? No, again. No, again. All right, let's see. No. It's a bag shop. It's a nice bag. I want this bag. How much is it? It's seven dollars. Did you see a boy? He is wearing blue pants. Blue pants? He's over there. The boy who is wearing blue pants, he's over there. Is this Tom, everyone? No, teacher. Oh, not again. All right, let's check. Not again. It's a toy shop. Did you see a boy? He is wearing a yellow hat, a red shirt, and blue pants. I'm sorry, I didn't see a boy. Oh, sorry, I didn't see the boy. Say the clown. Mom, are you 
okay. Where were you? Oh, where were you, Tom? Mm -hmm. Now that you met still each busy? other. No, I'm not busy. Now let's buy your robot and crayons. Yes, now his mom is not busy anymore. Yes, they are going to buy some robot and crayons together after they meet each other at the shopping mall. That's all with other stories of mom is too busy with shopping. So student, have you enjoyed with our story? Yes. Great work everyone. All right, and now with part of story box. So after we have watched the stories already, this time student, we are going to find out more with part of words. Yes, let's learn more with the news word from part of bird box. Word box. And here's everyone part of word box. Do you have a lot of words that we are going to practice by listen and say together? Let's begin with the first one. Are you ready? Yes. Yes, listen carefully. Ten. Ten. Yes, say with me. Ten. Ten. Your turn. Ten. Ten. Good job, ten. Like this number, number ten. And now let's listen and say it one more time. Ten. Ten. So your turn. Ten. Ten. Excellent, everyone. Yeah, it's number ten. And now let's practice more with part of sentence. It's ten dollars. Repeat after me. It's ten dollars. Your turn. It's ten dollars. Excellent. All right. Now keep going to our next word. And the next one is for. Look at them. Pet. Pet. Say with me. Pet. Pet. Your turn. Pet. Pet. Yes. What kind of this pet, everyone? Kitten. Kitten. Yes, this is kitten and the cat here. All right. Excellent. Let's say out of work one more time. So listen. Pet. Pet. Now your turn. Pet. Pet. Very nice. So pet. All right. Let's find out more with other sentence. This one is. It's a pet shop. Repeat after me. It's a pet shop. Your turn. It's a pet shop. Well done, everyone. All right. And now let's find out with the next one for today. The next word is for. Toy. Toy. Repeat after me. Toy. Toy. Your turn. Toy. Toy. Yes, excellent. Here it's a toy car. All right, practice more by listen and say. Toy. Toy. So, your turn. Toy. Toy. Yes, like this yo-yo too. It's some kind of toy. And this part still then. Let's find out with our sentence. I want a toy car. Repeat after me. I want a toy car. Your turn. I want a toy car. Good job, everyone. All right, this time. Let's move to our next one. The next one is... Shop. Shop. Say with me. Shop. Shop. Your turn. Shop. Shop. Yes, like we found from our picture. Here is a small shop. It's kind of store or some kind of grocery. You can buy a lot of things from these shops. All right, now listen and say it one more time. Shop. Shop. Your turn. Shop. Shop. Yes, and when you get to the shopping mall, you can find out with a lot of chalk in there. All right, now let's practice with other sand hands. Listen. Let's go shopping. Repeat after me. Let's go shopping. Your turn. Let's go shopping. Do you want to go shopping? Yes. All right, let's go shopping. So now everyone, yes, let's move to the next word for today. And the next one is for... Cute. Cute. Say with me. Cute. Cute. Your turn. Cute. Cute. Oh, yes. Look at the little girl and her doll over there. It's so cute. All right, this part. Let's practice with other words. Listen and say it one more time. Cute. Cute. So, your turn. Cute. 
cute. Excellent, everyone. Cheese look cute. Very nice. Let's pluck this with the same hands. It's a cute hat. Repeat after me. It's a cute hat. Your turn. It's a cute hat. Yes, Tom mom, according to the story, she's by a cute hat. All right, everyone. Now, let's move to the next word for today. The next one is for... Seven. Seven. Repeat after me. Seven. Seven. Your turn. Seven. Seven. Very nice. Like this number. Seven. So now, practice more by listen and say. Seven. Seven. So, your turn. Seven. Seven. Excellent. Like this pink number. Number seven. And now, everyone, practice with the same hands. It's seven dollars. Repeat after me. It's seven dollars. Your turn. It's seven dollars. Wonderful. All right, now let's find out more, everyone. This time, our next word is... Pants. Pants. So say with me, pants. Pants. Your turn. Pants. Pants. Yes, everyone, these are long pants. So in another way, you can call this one for trousers. It's the same, student. But now, practice with this word. So listen and say. Pants. Pants. Your turn. Pants. Pants. Great work. All right, this part, let's find out with our sentence. So this sentence is... I want pants. Say with me, I want pants. Your turn. I want pants. Well done, everyone. All right, let's move to the next word. The next one is for... Robot. Robot. So say with me, robot. Robot. Your turn. Robot. Robot. Yes, he is a robot. Do you want a robot? Yes. Oh, yes, he's look cute. All right, this time, let's say out the word one more time. Robot. Robot. So, your turn. Robot. Robot. Excellent. And let's find out more with part of same hands. I want a robot. Repeat after me. I want a robot. Your turn. I want a robot. Very nice, everyone. All right, let's move to next word. And our next one is for... Crayon, crayon. Repeat after me. Crayon, crayon. Your turn. Crayon, crayon. Excellent. This is a green crayon. All right, this time, let's practice by listen and say. Crayon, crayon. So, your turn. Crayon, crayon. Very nice, everyone. Find out more with our sentence. I want a crayon. Say with me, I want a crayon. Your turn. I want a crayon. Excellent. All right, let's move to the next word for today. The next one is... Shirt. Shirt. Yes, repeat after me. Shirt. Shirt. Your turn. Shirt. Shirt. Excellent. This is the blue shirt. All right, this time, let's practice by listen and say. Shirt. Shirt. So, your turn. Shirt. Shirt. Great work. Or without a sentence, this sentence is for... I want a shirt. Repeat after me. I want a shirt. Your turn. I want a shirt. Very nice, everyone. All right, this time, we move to our next words for today. And the next word is for... Yeah. Bag. Bag. Say with me, bag, bag, your turn. Back, back. Well done, it's the bag, everyone. All right, let's practice more by listen and say. Bag, bag. Your turn. Back, back. Yes, like a school bag. And now, let's practice with the same hands. I want a bag. So, repeat after me. I want a bag. Your turn. I want a bag. Excellent. So now let's find out more. And the next word is for 
Eight. Eight. Say with me. Eight. Eight. Your turn. Eight. Eight. Yes, we found with this number. It's for number eight. And now, student, let's listen and say it one more time. Eight. Eight. So, your turn. Eight. Eight. Well done. Let's practice with other sentence. It's eight dollars. Say with me. It's eight dollars. Your turn. It's eight dollars. Excellent, student. All right, now let's move to our next word. The next one is for dollar. Dollar. Say with me. Dollar. Dollar. Your turn. Dollar. Dollar. Yes, look at this bank. It's for one dollar. All right, now listen and say out your word. Dollar. Dollar. So your turn. Dollar. Dollar. Very nice. Like you. One dollar. All right, practice with other sentence. It's one dollar. Say with me. It's one dollar. Your turn. It's one dollar. Great work, students. So now we move to audio. Lots of vocabularies from part of Buzz Bob. The last one is for. Nice. Nice. Say with me. Nice. Nice. Your turn. Nice. 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 Yes. Look at the picture. These are nice crayon. Oh, wow. It's so colorful. All right. Practice with audio word. Bye. Listen and say. Nice. Nice. So, your turn. Nice. Nice. Very nice. All right. Now, practice more with audio sentence. These are nice crayons. Repeat after me. These are nice crayons. Your turn. These are nice crayons. Yes, according to our picture, these are nice crayons. Very nice, everyone. So now, this part of word box, we have practiced with other words already. Bye, listen, and say. So let's move to the next part for today, everyone. And this time, we are going to practice with other exercise from other workbook. Yes, now, let's find out your book? workbook and your worksheet beside you, student. And your workbook here, you have to open it on page 4 and 5. And part of page 4 and 5, student, it's look the same with the screen one. All right, let's practice together. So, student, don't forget to find out your pen. Or maybe you can use some pencil or colors or crayons. It's according to you. So, this time, with other exercise, we call items and jobs. Yes, student, we have pictures of the items and a lot of jobs that we have. And we are going to the shopping mall. Yes, absolutely, student. We can find out with a lot of jobs in there. All right, let's practice together. So, let's begin with part of page 4, student. So, we have 4 items over there. Say with me. First item is for doll. Your turn. Doll. Followed by book. Your turn. Book. Next one for pet. Your turn. Pet. The last item is for apple. Your turn. Apple. Well done. Let's check out with other jobs, student. The first job is for bookstore. Your turn. Bookstore. Followed by pet shop. Your turn. Pet shop. And next one, supermarket. Your turn. Supermarket. The last one for toy shop. Your turn. Toy shop. Great work, student. All right. Let's find out the right job, student. Doll. If you need a doll, you can get into which shop, everyone? The doll? At the toy shop. Oh, toy shop shop. Yes, it's it. All right. Let's draw in the line to connect. The doll to the toy shop, student. This one teacher will use red line. Match doll to toy shop. Excellent. All right, and then let's check up with another one. If you need some books, student. Where will you get the books, student? Which shop? Bookstore. Oh, you say bookstore. All right, that's right. All right, now let's draw in the line. The book to the bookstore. This time, teacher used green line. Let's find out more, everyone. And now, if you need some pet, student, maybe the dog or the kitten, something. The pet, where will you get the pet, student? 
from which shops? Pet shop. Yes, from the pet shop. Well done. Now let's connect the line. The pet to the pet shop. Very nice. And then are the last item all paid for. So if you want some apple, oh student, you can buy the apple from the supermarket. Supermarket. Excellent. Yes, it's the right one. You can buy some apples from the supermarket. Very nice. This time, student, that's all we cut off paid for. Have you finished everyone? Yes. Excellent. All right, now this time, we are going to find out more with part of page 5. So page 5, we are going to do with the same direction. We have 4 more items and 4 more shops. So say with me, first item is for shirt. Your turn. Shirt. Followed by ice cream. Your turn. Ice cream. Next one, crayons. Your turn. Crayons. The last one, these are shoes. Your turn. Shoes. Great work. What about the chops that we have? The first one here is from ice cream shop. Your turn. Ice cream shop. Followed by dress shop. Your turn. Dress shop. The next one is for shoe store. Your turn. Shoe store. The last one is for stationery store. Your turn. Stationery store. Excellent. Let's match the right pictures, the right item to the right shop. Shirt, student. If you wore the shirt, you will buy the shirt for... Dread shop. Dread shop. Very nice. Yes, you can buy other shirt from the dread shop. That's right. Let's draw with the line to connect the item to the right shop. Next one is for ice cream, student. If you need some ice cream, you have to go to the... Ice cream shop. Ice cream shop. Very nice. Yes, you need to get to the ice cream shop to buy some ice cream. Well done. What about the next one? These are crayons, student. If you need some crayons, you can get the crayons from stationery store. Yes, the stationery store. Very nice. Let's connect the line crayons to stationery store. And then other lot items for today. Choose, student. If you need some shoes, new shoes, you can buy the shoes from the shoe store. Shoe store. Well done. Yes, let's connect the line shoes to the shoe store. Excellent. Oh, yes, student, this part, we can find out the right items to the right shops from part of page 4 and 5 already. Have you finished everyone? Yes. Excellent. And that's all with our exercise for today. All right, this time, we are going to practice more with our activities. So, we move to part of student book. Student book. Everyone, this one, we are going to practice with our student book. Let's bring it beside you. And this activity is for where do you buy the robot? Where do you buy a robot? Talk about the right place to buy things. Yes, student. Where do you buy a bag? So, this part of our activities is according to your page 4 on your student book, student. We are going to talk about the right place to buy the thing. If you need something, which places that you want to go? Alright, student. Now, we are at the... Shopping mall. Say with me, shopping mall. Your turn. Shopping mall. Yes, at the shopping mall. So, inside the shopping mall, we have a lot of shops, student. First one, say with me, stationery. Your turn. Stationery. Followed by toy shop. Your turn. Toy shop. Next one for dread shop. Your turn. Dread shop. And next one for back store. Your turn. Back store. Followed by bookstore. Your turn. Bookstore. Our last one is for pet shop. Your turn. Pet shop. All right. The first questions asking for listen and say with me. Where do you buy a bag? Where do you buy a bag? Your turn. Where do you buy a bag? Very nice, student. If you need a bag, where will you buy the bag, student? You can buy the bag from the... Which shop? Bag store. Or you say bag store. Bag store. Very nice. Good work. Good work. Bag store. Yes, say with me. Where do you buy a shirt? Alright, move to the next question. 
The next question is asking for listen. Where do you buy a shirt? Where do you buy a shirt? Your turn. Where do you buy a shirt? Yes, everyone. If you need some shirt, where will you buy the shirt, student? You can buy the shirt from the dress shop. Oh, you say dress shop. All right, let's check out dress shop. Yes, that's right. Fantastic. Fantastic. Dress shop. The next question. Where do you buy a cat? Yes, say with me. Where do you buy a cat? Where do you buy the cat? Your turn. Where do you buy a cat? Well done, everyone. If you want some cat or some other pet, where do you buy the cat? So you can buy the cat from the pet shop. Pet shop. Oh, excellent. Let's check up together. Pet shop. Yes, pet shop is the All right, right one. All right. Pet shop. Move to the next question. Where do you buy a book? Practice with me. Where do you buy a book? Where do you buy a book? Your turn. Where do you buy a book? Good job, everyone. If you need some books, where do you buy a book? See then, you can buy a book from the... Bookstore. Or you say bookstore. All right, let's find out together. Bookstore. Yes, it is. It's for me bookstore. Good work. Good work. Bookstore. The bookstore. Where do you buy a toy car? Yes, now we move to our next question. This question is... Where do you buy a toy car? Say with me. Where do you buy a toy car? Your turn. Where do you buy a toy car? Excellent. If you need some toys or a toy car, where do you buy them, student? You can buy them from the... Toy shop. Oh, toy, yes. Toy. Excellent, everyone. Great work. Toy. From the toy. Where do you buy crayons? Now, student, we move to other large questions from this part. Say with me. Where do you buy crayons? Where do you buy crayons? Your turn. Where do you buy crayons? Yes, still that. If you need some crayons, where do you buy the crayons? Stationery store. Ah, oh, it would be stationery. Excellent. Stationery. Great work. Stationery. Yes, that or still that. Excellent! We can find out the right thing with the right places from our shopping mall already. Really excellent! Alright, it's time still then. We are going to find out with our new song. Yes, the new story. Also the new song too. And this song we call, How Much Is It? So for the first time for today, we are going to listen, practice how to sing and dance with other song together. All right, now let's listen to the whole song, everyone. How much, how is, much it? is it? What do you want? I want a shirt. How much is it? It's eight dollars. Here you are. We are going to practice with how to sing other song together. Now we have the boy and his mom. That's the boy. He needs his robot. But his mom, he needs the shirt. Let's practice with how to sing other song section by section. The first section is for What do you want? Now sing follow me, student. What do you want? Your turn. What do you want? Next one is for I want a shirt. Sing with me. I want a shirt. Your turn. I want a shirt. Well done. The next part is for... How much is it? Sing follow me. How much is it? Your turn. How much is it? Great work. And the next part is for... It's eight dollars. Sing with me. It's eight dollars. Your turn. It's eight dollars. Let's move to the next one. The next section is... Here you are. 
sing with me. Here you are. Your turn. Here you are. And the next one is for thank you. Sing follow me everyone. Thank you. Your turn. Thank you. Great work. Let's move to the next part. So here, let's sing it again. What do you want? Sing follow me. What do you want? Your turn. What do you want? All right, the boy sing. I want a robot. Say with me. I want a robot. Your turn. I want a robot. After that, the next section is for... How much is it? Now, how much is it? Your turn. How much is it? Excellent. The price is for... It's seven dollars. Sing, follow me. It's seven dollars. Your turn. It's seven dollars. After that... Here you are. This part, here you are. Your turn. Here you are. The last sections of our song is... Thank you. Sing follow me. Thank you. Your turn. Thank you. Excellent, student. That already the home song of how much is it? All right, student. This time, let's stand up, everyone. Yes, teacher will give you some tips with how to dance with other song. All right, for the first section that we sing, what do you want? You have to point your hand together like this. Yes, and then point from your Left, right side to left side yes what do you want like this after that i want a shirt you have to point your thumb to yourself start it with your right again i want a shirt excellent one more time i want a shirt very nice next part is we sing how much is it you have to roll in your hands together how much is it excellent and then part of it's eight dollars uh, move your hands for eight students eight like this it's eight dollars well done yes after that here you are move your hand begin with your right and left yes here you are part of thank you do it like this the same yes thank you all right the next part do it again with what do you want student practice with me what do you want yes great work now i want a robot Point your thumbs to yourself again. Begin with your right to left. Yes, I want a robot. Good job. Then how much is it? Rolling your hands together. Excellent. This one, the price is for? It's seven dollars. Yes, for seven. Five and two like this. It's seven dollars like this. After that, here you are. Begin with your right. Here you are. Turn to left. One more time. Here you are. Good job. And then the last section for thank you. Good job, everyone. Yes, now we have learned with how to sing and dance with the song of how much is this already. This time. Let's Warm practice up. by sing and dance together, student. All right, are you ready? Yes. Say it up first. Sing and dance together. What do you want? I want a shirt. How much is it? It's eight dollars. Here you are. Thank you. What do you want? I want a robot. How much is it? It's seven dollars. Here you are. Thank you. Yes, everyone. All right, now this time let's practice more. So sing and dance together one more time. What do you want? I want a shirt. How much is it? It's eight dollars. Here you are. Thank you. What do you want? I want a robot. Today, this song that we call 